Sheridan, and I'm here with my husband, Ken. Welcome. Hi, everyone. Hi. Welcome Good to, to Page see Turner you. Award Ceremony. Good to see you. We have our son, Kent, who's created that fantastic video introduction that just welcomed you. Ken is in the background, and he is producing the show, and he's got a stunning red carpet moment for you at the end of the show, so please make sure you stay right to the end to see everything. Before we carry on, I see, I'm just going to put you on, on gallery view. I can see so many, oh, look at that, so many beautiful people. Hello, everybody. Hello, wave, wave, wave. You know, Ken and I have been talking to you all for a, over a year now. And it's absolutely amazing to see you here. So thank you so much for coming to join us today. It's wonderful to see you. It's just really, really great. So um, I'll take you off gallery view. So um, tonight we're going to have several writers' lives are going to change. And it's so exciting. Ken and I've been working on this and Ken's in the background. We've all been working on this for many, many months. And the last few weeks have been very intensive. So um, it's, uh, it's going to be great. Okay, listen, great to see so many of you joining us here. This is Page Turner Awards uh, year two. We've got five awards to go through this year. We've got two new ones over and above what we ran last year, and they are the Screenplay Award and the Young Writer Award. Um, we're very proud of how Page Turner has grown this year, and in particular, how its diversity has really grown and, and fanned out. And whilst there's still plenty more to, to do in this area, um, we're very pleased to see so many different uh, writers and authors of different cultures and backgrounds entering the award and moving through all the different stages of the awards as we as we pass along through the judging process. I do have to share one diversity stat with you, um, and that is when I when I look at all of our shortlisted writers and authors across all awards, all eighty eight of you, then um, seventy percent. Uh, of the of all shortlisted writers and authors are women so only 30 uh, percent male and the only award where uh, the men are doing better than the women is the screenplay area if I take that out just to see how that affects the stats then we've got 82 percent of our shortlisted authors and writers are women great I mean poor old Reuben Mainprize in the in the young he's the only male young writer on the shortlist down there he's fairly feeling fairly lonely I imagine so the, the writing is pretty clear and that is the guys are getting beaten to a standstill by the <laughs> girls and uh, guys are gonna have to up their game a bit if they want to change that and the girls are gonna have to do something to we not girls, let them. <laughs> we girls we're gonna have to get onto the screenplay start writing more screenplays yeah now we have uh writers and authors from over 20 countries uh, with us this evening or this morning or this afternoon wherever you might be um and we've got um, a time zone span of some 20 hours. We've got West Coast America, which is just after 10 o'clock in the morning. And we've got writers and authors down in New Zealand and they're looking at 6 a.m. On, on Wednesday morning. We got um, Umran Lee in the Philippines. She's looking at one o'clock in the morning, but as she's a young writer, I dare say she probably would have been up anyway. So uh, a real span, but if, you, if we were giving out awards for who's who's feeling the most pain in getting here tonight, then it would have to be our writers and authors down there in Australia. They're looking at a very rude 3 a.m. To, to, to be here, and I see many of them have joined. So well done for, for setting the alarm, getting up, joining, and it's, it's a pleasure that you've, uh, that you've made it. Um, now, just one small piece of housekeeping regarding internet. Uh, we're coming to you from the hills above Malaga, southern Spain, and whilst it's gorgeous here, it's not unknown for electrical storms to hit and the local energy supplier throwing a wobbly and, and cutting the electricity. If that happens, uh, we lose the internet. Now, Kent, who's in our production facility in the UK, sounds very grand, but he's all fibre optic up, so, up, so, so we're, 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 pretty, we're pretty sure he's, he's bulletproof over there. So you won't be logged out or kicked out of the show. Just hang on for a few minutes and then Paul and I will get back and the show will go on. But it's a, it's a lovely evening down here, so I'm pretty optimistic we're gonna, be, uh, we're gonna remain okay. And I hope the internet for all of you is the same because I know you'll be logging on from different parts of the globe on different devices and that can all get a bit scratchy sometime, but hopefully we'll all, we'll all be able to stick with it. Okay, so 
Let's crack on with um, our first award. And our first award that we're going to tackle is going to be the Screenplay Award. And that brings me to a very special guest of ours tonight, Paul Michael Glazer. Paul, good morning to you. Thanks so much for joining us. Hi, thank you very much for having me. I'm honored. What a what a what a collection of writers you got here. Yeah, yeah, it, 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 it's it's uh, it's 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 very impressive, uh, I have to say. And I mean, it's as as you've as you've noticed, you know, they're they're, they're writers and authors from all across the spectrum of of yeah. writing, from from screenplay to to manuscripts, etc. And and a lot of new writers a lot of yeah. starting out on their journey so they're going to be very inspired by having you here tonight to talk to us yeah okay uh let's get to our third award and this is the young writer award and it's uh, a new addition to page turner awards this year and it's been a lot of fun um it's for young writers between the ages of 18 and 25 and um, I mean, as Anne pointed out, we had uh, a, a number of writers who are younger than that um, enter the awards, but we've had to restrict the final selection to the 18 to 25 year old uh, rule. But, but it's clear there is, there is huge writing talent out there. And in fact, an awful lot of our shortlisted authors have described how they've been writing for, for, for many, many years, from the time they were 8, 12, 14. So they're, they're pretty experienced um, at this stage. But before we get into much more of that, let's take a look at the shortlist for the Young Writer Award. Okay, now for many of our young writers, not all of them by any stretch of the imagination, um, this was their first uh, international writing competition. Um, some have been there before, many haven't. And for some, it was their first book and for others, it was maybe the second um, or third. But what's, what's very clear, you know, right across all of the young writers is it's, it's not a hobby to them. <laughs> they're, they're very committed, they're very passionate and they're very, determined um, and if you if you look at you know I just pull out a couple of the um, uh, a couple of our young writers if I look at Reuben Mainprice he scored very well with the spies uh, diploma he already has a seven book plan going forward about where he wants to take that series um, and now if I'm correct I think you know, Reuben's 19 and he's just started his university degree at Bristol University in England so he, he might struggle to get much fiction writing done over the next few years, but he's clearly a young man with a plan and uh, he's going to be a serious writing talent going forward. If I look at Jasmine Burke in, in, in the US, she already has an author writing site to showcase her work, to build her fan base and to engage with it. She's very serious about her you know, writing development. And if I look at Hayley Watson, another young author who scored fantastically well, and um, it, it was her first book, I believe, and now she's you know, wholly committed to quickly going to the, uh, to the second one. So fantastic amount of talent um, out there. And it's gonna be really interesting to see where all of these young writers take their writing career going forward. And we hope to see many of them return to Page Turner Awards uh, in the future, but it's, it's quite clear there's a, there's a very deep pool of talent there. And many of them I'm sure are going to find writing success. Okay, but who's won the award? Okay, and now to help us do that, um, I want to welcome Jenny Harrison. Jenny is the author of youngwriter.co.uk. Editorial manager. Ed editorial manager, sorry, of uh, youngwriter.co.uk. So she's already heavily immersed in um, young writing talent and she's, she's helped judge our young writers' uh, submissions this year. So Jenny, welcome to you. Hi, Ken and Paula. Thank you for having me. It's amazing to be here. See all this Lovely amazing to have you. talent. Did you did you enjoy some of the submissions, Jenny, that you came across this year? Absolutely. I had such a good time. Honestly, it didn't feel like I was doing it at work, and it did not feel like work reading all those amazing submissions. I had such a brilliant time. Just the wealth of imagination and just 
honestly, I couldn't believe that the right the standard. It was just brilliant. That's that's fantastic to hear. Thank you for telling us that. And all our young writers who are watching and here, listen to this. This is what um, Jenny is saying. You you're all very very talented. Now, Jenny, you you have the winner's envelope in front of you there. Do you want to <laughs> pop it open and unveil? Okay, so uh, here we go. So this winning young writer entered a number of different award categories within this year's Page Turner Awards. She ended up on the shortlist for the Writing Mentorship Award and was shortlisted in the Writing Award, one of Page Turner's biggest and most competitive awards. She actually entered two submissions into the Young Writer Award. One finished first and the other finished second, which is astonishing. So she's obviously a very um, writing, great writing talent already. She entered the Page Turner Awards just on a whim. So I think she's probably very glad that she did so. So the winner of the Young Writer Award for her submission, The Other Side of Sunshine, is Jaden Groth. Congratulations. Oh, Jaden! <laughs> oh. oh, it's so early in the morning, guys. Oh my gosh. We must tell you that Jaden has woken up at about three in the morning to attend. <laughs> Yeah, Jaden's one of our uh, writers and uh, authors from Australia. Australia. So, so she's she's had to deeply commit to this. And we kept making sure, we kept saying, are you sure it's okay to get up at three in the morning? Because we wanted to make sure yeah. she could be here. <laughs> Jaden, tell us tell about us. it. How are you feeling? Um, I'm like very happy and stressed. <laughs> um, but good stressed. Oh, yeah, I entered on a whim because my other writing friends were entering um, and I just didn't think much of it. So it's been it's been so amazing. And oh, the other entries have been awesome. It's been so nice reading everyone's work and just being surrounded by so many amazing writers. And and my friends all know I've just been like stressed for the last three weeks. So this has just been really great. Thank you so much. Well, congratulations, Jaden. You are our very first winner of the Young Writer Award. And uh um, you know, we will talk to you later on about a few things about how Page Turner Awards can help you. But in the meantime, um, soak up the enjoyment of winning the award and good luck with any plans you have of going back to bed. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. And thank you for joining us, Jenny, for, um, for you know, announcing that. That must have been very delightful to knowing that you've read both of Jaden's um, submissions and now here you are to announce her as the winner. So thank you for coming along. Oh, it's absolutely my pleasure.